Everyday superpower where we talk body language, relationships, game and everything in between. Yo, where do we go from this one? I'm just going to tell you this, right? She wants, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, yes. She wants a go-getter, yeah? She wants, am I making sense to you? Do you disagree that she wants a go-getter? Do you not think that a woman would want someone who is ambitious, driven, aspiring for more? aspiring for more resources going out and getting what they want what they deserve and attaining if not developing momentum to establish first place number one do you disagree with me huh do you disagree well if you don't disagree Let's talk about it, and if you do disagree, let's talk about it nonetheless. She wants a go-getter, right? So what's stopping you from thinking this way and acting ruthless? Ruthless and toothless. You've got one life, it's finite. You only get so many younger years before you get old and slow, and the, the, the first part is sad, just absorbing BS from the system and hearing about this that and the third now you have your independence as a man you should go and forge your way and if it's not there for you you should bloody just smash your way through it and get it done she is gonna be repulsed by a slow slug of a man she's gonna be repulsed by a lazy oaf of a man when there's men out there going and getting it even at the very least, this man's going to work, yeah? He's going to work. He's going out and getting what he needs in order to provide the resources for his family. You can't be unemployed living at home talking about game and why why, why don't women want me. You're living with your mum. You're not a man. Go out and get... Oh, and don't, don't get me started on the Everybody's recommended I stay home so I can save money and do this and that. Hey, each to their own, that's fine, but you're going to be a child whilst you're there. I perceive you as a child. If you're a grown man living at home, getting looked after by your mum, whether you do or don't, that's how I perceive it, because you're not independent, and independence is masculine. And that independence locks on with the drive that is a necessity for a man to go forward i've spoken to so many women and i ask them what qualities do you want in the man and before any form of status or financial revenue and income comes in the first thing is i need to be with an ambitious man i need to be with an ambitious man I'm telling you, it's ever so important. Oh, why is she attracted to the drug dealer and not me? I can hold a stable job. Because he shows entrepreneurial effort. In his own way, he might have taken the other route. But if you have to question that, you're not looking at the reality of who that man is compared to you. And the showcasing of his characteristics that he has got over you. He's an ambitious, entrepreneurial man who's taken his route and that's why women are attracted to him let alone the danger but but then let's talk about that let's say you're on the straight and narrow but you're still showcasing the same drive and ambition there's danger involved yes most definitely because you're a risk taker and men are more averse to risk did you know the higher someone's testosterone the more likely they are to take risks and what do they say as far as money making is concerned the higher the risk risk the higher the reward the higher the return that's not to say you don't take calculated risks. We're not stupid. We're not impulsive. But we as men have a particular mind that when we accentuate specific features of our identity, not only gives us life in the reality of what we are, gives us power in what we have and what we've been given for our biological hardwiring women are into that because women are feminine and our masculine output and masculine traits and showcase of such are incredibly enticing and magnetic 
take a risk, have drive, have ambition, pursue everything that means something to you. What do they say? You lose money chasing women, but you won't lose women chasing money. That's fact. That's a brief one, but I'm leaving it on that one. That's game for you right there. Go get it, man. Go get it. Click like and subscribe. I'm uploading every day. I got two links down in the description. One will take through to the catalogue of body language. Over 220 videos of how to read people through their subconscious behaviour. It's how you read minds. It's free. It's on YouTube. Second to that is the Patreon, where I will join you in watching real life first date footage. I'll break down attraction body language, repulsion body language. You'll see it manifest in the world around you, wherever you live, because it's hardwired in all of us. That's the game they won't teach you elsewhere. I'm signing out. Peace.